Hey everybody, this is Scott Grammer and I am the old audio guy and what you're looking at is the power amplifier section of a Marantz 2235B receiver and I am halfway through replacing the insulators under the power transistors. These are the old ones, these are the new ones. And the reason that we're doing this, and you can see they're considerably different, is this. Um, the output transistors in an amplifier get hot as you play the amplifier and that heat has to go somewhere. So they're mounted on an aluminum piece that we call a heat sink and its purpose is to draw heat away from the transistors and dissipate it into the air. Now the transistors cases are connected to the power supply and the heat sink is grounded to the chassis. So we can't have them just directly bolted to the heat sink, they have to be insulated. So the way they did that in the 70s was they used a mica insulator and the mica insulator, let me show you one of the old ones here, is coated on both sides with silicon grease or well today we would call it thermal compound but back then it was just called silicon grease and the purpose of the silicon grease is to fill in uh, microscopic irregularities in the bottom of the transistor in the mica insulator on both sides and in the surface of the heat sink and conduct heat through all of those little irregularities that otherwise would impede the transfer of heat. The problem is that after so many years the thermal compound or silicon grease loses its ability to do this. It becomes hard and it contracts and the result is your transistors start to run hotter even though the heat sink doesn't feel very warm and this can lead to a fried amplifier if you like to play it loud. So I replace them with these little blue insulators. These blue insulators are made of a cloth that is impregnated with thermal compound and they do a much better job of transferring heat than the, the silicone grease and the mica ever did. They're good insulators as far as electricity and they will not go bad with age. So when I see an amplifier where the silicone grease looks like it has started to turn brown or where I don't see any silicone grease, uh, I will go ahead and just change out those insulators and that's what I'm in the middle of doing now. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.